we are hosting a caucus around the future economies, centered on SDG 8, which is very relevant and very important, not only in our region in Africa, but on a global scale at large. We'll be discussing everything SDG 8 around decent work and economic growth, and we hope that we inspire change, not only to those who attended online and in person, but to those who are impacted by our conversation. As a leading player in the technology industry, we play a pivotal role. We have to be here. 4IR and SDG 8 are critical to the future of our world. And here tonight, with conscious capitalism at our core and a philanthropic soul, we're here to work together to solve for a future, courageously and exponentially. I am basically here today to give some of my advice on how to tackle youth unemployment, not just here in South Africa, but across the continent. This is a super important topic, and I'm really glad that you guys will all be here to listen in and learn some tips. I think when you're looking at um, the definition of, of decent work, there are lots of different criteria that you have to look at. But by and large, it's about looking at young people getting jobs where they will be paid and they'll be paid at fair rates and where they will be safe and secure in working in those environments. The One Year World Summit is really just where the journey begins. But the real magic happens when you're able to access your lifetime membership to this amazing community in person. I'm looking forward to the magic tonight and really welcoming our 2021 ambassadors. In 2019, when my other colleagues and I came back from the summit in London, we started the first employee resource group at EOH for the under 35 population with the purpose to ensure that EOH remains relevant and socially impactful. This employee resource group we call the Youth Solvers to ensure that the youth voice is at decision making tables. We've got a target of 12,000 meals that we will be packing in one hour today. Those meals that we'll be packing today is going to go to early childhood development centres, better known as a crash. That 12,000 meals that they've packed in an hour is enough to feed 46 children five meals a week for an entire year. So that is the difference that they are making. That means that the principals don't actually need to go and physically buy food to feed these kids. That savings that they create needs to be reinvested back into the ECD to either buy educational toys for the kids, first aid kits or anything that will benefit the ECD in whatever it is they want to achieve within a five year period. Mm -hmm.